take your nebulizer out. Is this part or the whole thing? That part and the T piece next. Without the mouth. Oh, the mouthpiece is already on. What I want oh, to emphasize the is the mouthpiece, did it come in a separate plastic pack? Yes, it did. Let's put it back in its little plastic. Okay. I want to show you that so the mouthpiece so comes in a little plastic pack. You just tear a hole in it, put the mouthpiece on without touching it. That's okay. what I want to emphasize. Okay, I threw that back away, so okay. I'm just going to do this. Okay, do that. This is, this is what you do. <laughs> Assemble it so that you don't touch it. See, this other way. Okay. Sorry. Good. Now you've got that together and you'll have your gloves on. I want you to have gloves on to do this. Yes. Then you'll put your nebulizer together. Now put your uh, reservoir on. Should the mouthpiece still be covered by the plastic? Uh, yeah, I like to keep it covered and let the patient okay, take the cover off. Okay, okay. Well, I understand. I just want to make sure. Yeah, I always do that if it's new or if you're working, make sure you don't touch it either way you cut it. And I'm also gloved. Yeah, okay. and put your tubing in. Is this what we're going to have to do for the proficiency? Uh -huh. Yes. So we're not going to use the mask? Well, you can use the mask or this. It's either okay. way because you can it prop it in his mask, sit. in his mouth, and it stays there. Oh, okay. Because he kind of wedge it in between his, uh, in his mouth and it stays there. Yeah, but it's at an angle, right? Yeah, or you can put the mask like on. This. If you're going to do the mask, let's do the mask. Go ahead and do it, and we'll show you how you do that. No, no, she's asking good questions. <laughs> I, I think it's good to either use either or. It's entirely up to you. Sorry, sir. Um, <laughs> I want to fail, okay? That's right. Like, you know, we want to get done the first time. Yeah. I don't want anybody to fail. Okay, now, the next thing I do is hold it in one hand and break the, break the cap off, yeah, snap it, you twist. Did you want me to do that? Yes. Okay. Now, I you can, think we were actually next thing you do, is you're going to open this mm -hmm. here just the way you do it is you open it and then you take and hold the other piece in your hand in a sterile sort of way like yeah that's okay that works just as long as that doesn't touch anything right now hold the vial up wait no a little higher like look, an inch yeah like an inch and fill it up now on this point i zoom the camera to see if you're maintaining sterile technique and i pass why people put it in there and shake it all around, it makes no sense to me, but you will see somebody do that. Okay. Oh, there it is. Did you get it? Okay. Okay. Now, where's your flow meter? We need flow meters. Uh, get a flow meter out of the... I told totally you need a flow one. meter. Oh, yeah. instead of not cleaning it up. Remember that? Plug it over there. But you're not my wife. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. okay. 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 Hook it up. Six or eight? Six or eight. Go eight. Just blast it. Well, eight, he said, was better, right? Yeah, you get better particle size between six and eight, not above Whoa. eight. Whoa. See, you know, get a nice mist there. Yeah. Put your mask on. Go ahead. <laughs> now, just sit down in case you feel lightheaded or dizzy. And take your treatment. No, and what we're doing now is watching her take the treatment. <laughs> Is it going to hurt the second water? <laughs> mm -hmm. Partial pressure of water might go up some. <laughs> Give it chest pain. Now what happens? Now what happens? You notice how it makes quite a mist? Yeah. You notice how the person breathes and you can see the fog appear and disappear? I've never smoked before. <laughs> but I do like... Use this to breathe through your nose or your mouth? Your mouth. You get more medicine that way. Remember your nose, what does your do? It filters. Yeah. It filters particles, it'll filter out the medicine, and you will get less medicine if you're breathing through your nose. It's hard to be a mouth breather, huh? It's better to take it by a mouthpiece. Yeah. It encourages uh, mouth people to breathe yeah. through the mouth. So, on my proficiency, we can choose either or. We can right. both or just one. Either or, it's all right with me. If you, okay. you, The point is, if it's on the simulator and he's breathing, you see the mist move back and forth just like a human does. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's pretty 
people. And that would go on, and during this process, you will have, uh, you know, you will check the peak flow, check the pulse, check the respiratory rate, ask about their level of dyspnea. <laughs> you will have done those things. Check peak flow? Peak flow, with the peak flow meter. With that little, the the little thing with the You do it before. before well, we're going to do that. Do you have your, you have your blue bag? I do, yes, We'll do sir. the peak flow. You want me to go ahead and turn this off? Yes. <laughs> you will take this, 